What's up guys, my name is Brandon, you guys can call me Swifters, and welcome back to a brand new Fortnite video here on my channel today. I've got something super awesome for you all that I'm very excited to share with you. Now this is a pretty secretive thing within Fortnite, a battle royale, and if I'm being honest, I recently just found out about this, and I don't necessarily know how long this has been in the game, but regardless, it is super, super cool, and I wanted to go ahead and let you guys know about this, because I'm not sure if all of you guys know exactly what I'm going to be showing you. Now I want you guys to let me know down in the comment section below what your favorite pickaxe to use in the game is. For me, mine has got to be the Rainbow Smash or the Unicorn pickaxe. I think it's super, super cool and that's my favorite pickaxe to use. But as I said, let me know your favorite pickaxe in the comment section below. But as I said, we're going to be taking a look at a secret feature on some pickaxes within Fortnite Battle Royale and I thought it was really, really interesting and super cool and I want to go ahead and let you guys know about it. Now, as far as I know, I believe that there are only three pickaxes within Fortnite that have some sort of animation attached to them, and we're actually going to be taking a look at two of these, because two of these pickaxes have one special feature that makes them super unique and very awesome. Now, the two pickaxes that have a secret feature are the Candy Cane Pickaxe and the Rainbow Smash Pickaxe. As I said, the Rainbow Smash is probably my favorite pickaxe in the game, but both the Rainbow Smash and the Candy Cane Pickaxe have a very unique feature that not many people may be aware of. So first, let's take a look at the Candy Cane Pickaxe, or the Candy Axe. If you notice, there are some lights flashing on the Candy Cane Axe, especially at the top. They aren't one distinct color, and they're not staying lit the entire time. They're flashing all these different colors, and they're going off at different intervals. Now, the crazy thing about this is that these lights can actually change throughout the game, and what I mean by that is as you get kills while you're playing Fortnite, one of the lights actually turns on, and it stays on throughout the rest of the duration of the game. Now the Candy Cane Axe, or the Candy Axe in my opinion, is one of the rarest pickaxes in the game, not only because it's super unique and really cool looking, but just because not very many people have it, because it was added into Fortnite at such an early time when not a lot of people were actually playing the game. So if you have this pickaxe, that means you are a OG Fortnite Battle Royale player, and I believe it was one of the first or second pickaxes that I actually purchased. I don't necessarily buy every skin, I don't buy every character item, but I do buy ones that I find to be really awesome, and the candy pickaxe was definitely one of them. But of course, going back to the main topic or point of today's video, and that's the fact that the candy axe has a special or secret feature added to it in regard to the lights. So you guys are going to see that I'm going to go ahead and get a kill with the pickaxe as one of my items equipped to my character. I just go ahead and get a kill, and you're actually going to see that when I pull out my pickaxe, one of the lights on the top of the pickaxe is now lit up, and it will stay lit up throughout the rest of the game. Now, of course, as you continue to play throughout that same exact game, the more kills that you get means the more lights that will appear on your candy axe. So you guys are going to go ahead and see that I'm going to take out this squad. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to save all of my teammates, but I'm going to go ahead and take out this squad, and by the time you see me kill all of them, we're going to go ahead and take a look at the pickaxe once again, and you're actually going to see that additional lights are now on the candy axe. Now you'll see that by the time I'm done killing the rest of these guys, not all of the lights on the candy axe are lit up, and that kind of confused me just because, if I'm not mistaken, I believe that there's only three, possibly four, big lights at the top of the candy axe, and I clearly have four kills within this game, but not all of the lights are going to be lit up, so I don't necessarily know if once you have two or three kills, you need to get upwards of maybe six or seven, maybe possibly more, in order to have all of the lights on the candy axe get lit up but again you guys will see in just a second that when I go ahead and pull out the candy axe and not all of the lights are gonna be lit up and it's from my understanding that there are about three or four on the top of the candy axe but not all of them appear to be lit up but regardless there is definitely more lights lit up than there originally was when I had initially gotten one kill in the game we have that purple one on the left hand side of the top that's sort of flickering but overall you can clearly see that as I continue to get or as you guys continue to get more kills as you're playing Fortnite, the lights on the pickaxe will start to glow. 
Now of course these lights do stay lit throughout the entire duration of the game and I thought it was a really cool feature that made the candy axe all that more rare and all that more cool even though in and of itself this pickaxe is one of the coolest looking in the game and I like to think that I'm a pretty knowledgeable person about Fortnite and I found it so interesting that I hadn't heard about this until about a week and a half ago but maybe you guys already knew about this feature on the candy axe and if you did let me know in the comment section below. Now, in addition to the Candy Axe having that special feature, we're going to go ahead and take a look at another pickaxe in the game that also has this really unique and awesome feature, and this, of course, is my favorite pickaxe in the game, the Rainbow Smash. Now, as you guys can see, if you were to go ahead and take a look at the Unicorn's Horn, you can clearly see that the horn is not lit up. There's no light to it, and nothing's going on with it, but like the Candy Pickaxe, as you play Fortnite Battle Royale, in one game, as you get kills, that horn on the Unicorn is actually going to start to light up. So of course when the game starts up my pickaxe it doesn't have any color to the unicorn's horn. I go ahead and get some kills while I have this pickaxe equipped onto my character and you guys will see when I go ahead and pull out the rainbow smash pickaxe after I go ahead and get a couple of kills the horn on the unicorn is actually going to be lit up. So you guys just saw I got my first kill on the roof and then I'm gonna go ahead and take this guy out and when I pull out my pickaxe again, the entire unicorn horn will be completely lit up. Now unlike the candy axe where as you get individual kills, specific lights start to turn on, the unicorn axe from the looks of it, once you get one or maybe two kills, the entire unicorn horn automatically turns on. As you guys saw, I didn't pull out my pickaxe when I killed that first guy, but I did once I got the second kill, so it's possible that after two kills the entire pickaxe shows up, and maybe after the first kill only half of it shows up, and then when you go ahead and get that second kill it lights up the entire thing. But obviously, it's a super unique and very cool feature that as far as I know only two pickaxes in the game have this specific animation to it where lights start to appear as you get kills throughout the game. Now of course, this information isn't revolutionary, it's not like it's a huge game changer, and some people may find it to be stupid, but as I said, I found this to be really cool, and I am a huge fan of all of the little things that the developers implement into the game to make the game all that more interesting and all that more unique and cool, and this is just one of the many things that they do, and as I said, I found this little feature for these two pickaxes to be super awesome. So if all of you guys knew this, and I just went ahead and brought you guys information that you thought to be stupid I'm sorry I apologize but if only one or two people didn't know about this and now you know after watching my video I think I did my job just fine but as I said let me know in the comment section below if this is a feature to these pickaxes that you guys already knew about or if this is something that you just recently found out about like I did about a week and a half ago so guys, that's going to be it for today's video. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please be sure to drop a like down below, subscribe if you're new, and turn on those notifications because I do upload daily Fortnite content here on my channel. While you guys are at it, make sure to click the links in the description to follow me on both Twitter and Instagram. I do my best to reply or acknowledge every tweet that's sent to me, and Twitter's a great way to stay connected with all of the information and updates about my life. On top of that, if you guys want to go ahead and follow me on Instagram, that would be super awesome because I'm trying to start posting more on there and I want to get a bigger following on Instagram so I can go ahead and really connect with you guys there aside from just connecting with all of you on YouTube. So again, go ahead and follow me on both Twitter and Instagram. The links to those can be found in the description below. Regardless guys, that's going to be it for today's video. I really hope you enjoyed it and with that being said, I'll be sure to catch you guys later.